What's up, y'all? Just wanted to come uh, get my thoughts on a few things. First, I wanted to talk about um, the whole Kobe Bryant situation. Um, I know a lot of people are mourning and sad over it. You know what I'm saying? But I don't, I don't mean to be mean and blunt, bro. And I know it's a 13 year old girl died, but y'all gotta wake up, bro. People have to wake up. Y'all don't see all these damn Hulu specials and Netflix series that they already got out, bro. Y'all can't tell that these things were previously shot. You got motherfuckers talk about the Grammy Awards. Guys, the Grammy Awards was pre-shot on Saturday. The only reason they weren't letting people in there on Sunday is because they were redoing that fucking thing. They were re-putting back, back the goddamn Lakers, the Lakers floor for the game. And I know people going to sit up here and say, and I don't, I don't give a fuck about the, the non-believers because I'm past that shit at this point, bro. I'm just speaking to the people who are woke. You know what I'm saying? Um, don't feel bad and mourn for this guy, bro. I'm not trying to, I'm not, I'm just going to keep it 100, bro. They all do the same thing. They all get down with the same Lord who is, who is saying they all go their own way. They don't give a fuck about righteousness. They don't give a fuck about, um, who, they don't give a fuck about anybody else's kids or kids in general. They only care about their own family. They're very selfish, evil people, and they'll keep the evil going as long on as long as they keep the paychecks rolling in. That's what you got. Y'all got to realize, man. So, yes, it was a sacrifice. Yes, it was for um, the furtherment of the brawn, but not really for the even for the furtherment of the brawn. Just a sacrifice for Satan, I think. I know it's going to sound kind of funny because people are going to be like, wait a minute, but LeBron is at the tattoo and he's supposed to be the... Yeah, don't worry. He is going to win the championship and stuff like that. But people, I'm pretty sure you can feel now that people have already... Oh, that took all the wind out of LeBron. I'm a LeBron fan, bro. And you can pretty much... My hips are... Right. But, um... Yeah, man, they don't, they know what's up, bro. They don't give a shit. The only reason they, and, um, LeBron knew too. You know, he he knew, you know what I'm saying? And don't get the fist, I'm not a fan of him because he's, because the, the evil shit they do, bro, but they, and, and, and a lot of times I be trying to give these people like a pass too because I'm a human, bro, you know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to act like I'm better than nobody. People do what they have to do for money and, and you know what I'm saying? All, we need money to survive and, who wouldn't want enough money where you can be past surviving and you just look, now you're comfortable. Everybody want to be comfortable. But at what cost? You know what I'm saying? So that's um, my whole dig on that. Then I wanted to get to P. Diddy. Sean Combs, bro. What the fuck are you doing? I seen your, this speech this nigga get did. Bruh. P. fucking Diddy. You sold your soul, my nigga. And I know you heard this. I know people have told you that shit a million fucking times. But it's going to be a million and fucking one today, my nigga. You sold your soul to these people. Everybody know that black dude, bro, Andre Harrell, left you a minute ago, my nigga. He was actually helping with Bad Boy and shit. Ever since then, everybody who has progressed Bad Boy forward has been of Jewish or Caucasian descent. And this nigga know it. Don't get up there talking about some... Y'all got 360. I know them people is looking like, man, who the fuck is you talking to? Who the fuck is Cuffy talking to? You a damn fool, man. And you see what they did to Kobe? I know you know they'll pop your ass, but I ain't got no problem with that shit. Y'all think that because these niggas been around 20, 30 fucking years, or they got 100, 200 million dollars, what PD got a billion? They don't give a shit, nigga. They took out Epstein. Y'all see how much money he got? Look, bro, stay safe out here. Stay, circ stay, stay circumspect. Stay praying to the Most High, man. You know what I'm saying? Pray to y'all Elohim and son y'all been Yahweh take us out this place. And then, and while we here, and while we here, keep us safe. And, let, and we don't want to rush anything. We're not, we're not trying to haste anything. We're just trying to let things go the way they go. Love our families, protect our families, love our communities, live life, and stay honest and humble. And and. And take the crumb, take the crumbs as well as the whole slices of bread in life. You know what I'm saying? I'll be back on YouTube. You know what I'm saying? I'll, I'll make another video, and I'm pretty sure I don't. I'm not making this channel be big or nothing to blow up. I'm just, a, I'm just, a reg, just a regular person speaking, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all have a great day, Barakatah.